Hey, how do you like this? I'm Danny Israel, and you're watching Tom Was Here. Hi, everyone. Tom was here, back at it with another mystery box. This one is from RSA, Rochester Sports Autographs, and it was their Black Friday special. They put out a Black Friday mystery box and a bunch of different sports. This is the basketball version, and what this was to be was it, to, it was to be either a jersey or a full-size basketball. Mm -hmm. As you can see, it's not a full-size basketball. Let's just deflate it. Um, most likely it's not. Um, but yeah, this is, um, this is the basketball version. And I wanted to do a, both a football and a basketball one when their season starts, when their season started. Um, but it did not happen. So we are doing this now. This is their Black Friday special. Mm -hmm. It is a basketball jersey, most likely. There were some big names. There were some big names available. Um, like LeBron, huh? LeBron, no, Jordan, um, Morant, no, Giannis, yes, thank god, yeah, so, uh, so yeah, Giannis was one of the names. There were a few different names on there that were pretty good. Um, hello? I don't know, um, but the boy opened up the football one, so I get to open up the basketball one and toy with him a bit. Watch him, he's gonna get something good, although. Okay. Let's hope he gets something good, because that football one was junk. What, Kenny Norman or whatever? Yeah. What team? I can't even tell. Okay. So, it the jersey is purple. There's a few different teams that have purple jerseys. Utah? Utah's one. It could have, like, a... Uh, there could be a... Uh, uh, very, Sacramento. Yeah, that's one. There's a very important one that's purple as well. Hmm. Could be Lakers, perhaps. Maybe, but yeah, Lakers would be yellow, I think. No, not necessarily. Uh, there's another one you haven't thought of based on the accent colors. Oh, it's Hornets. Not... Oh my god, please. Please. It's not who you think. Oh. I can. T oh, I know exactly who it is. I know exactly who it is. This is objectively a better Hold point. up. I want to see if I can get it. Or if I can see it. Or I can know who he is. No, it. you'll know exactly who it is. Really? Yeah. You're going to try to steal from me. Sure. Um, the impressive thing about this player, he wasn't a Hall of Famer from what I remember. I don't think he was a Hall of Famer. But he Tracy was very, McGrady? No, but he was oh, very damn. well known because... Playing a big man sport is easy when you're a big man. Playing a big man sport when you're one of the smallest players to ever play in the Mom. NBA uh, is a lot harder um, in that sense. Uh, because I think that's who this is. Malone? No. Oh, he's small. Right? No. Six, Malone's 6'9". Six, yeah, for a power forward, that's small. No, one of the smallest players to ever play in the sport. Oh, Spud Webb. The oh, other one. Let's go. <laughs> yes, the other oh, one. Oh, I want that in my room. That is. Oh, I want that in my room. Oh, that's a legend. Muggsy Bogues, Charlotte Hornets. Not the best pull oh, that could it is arguably the best pool. What do you mean? have been ever pulled. I'd rather have but that than I LeBron. appreciate Muggsy's ability to play uh, in a big man sport. I'd rather um, have this than LeBron. I had to pull... You're out of your mind. I had to pull no, out... this um, is a legend right here. Uh, I had to pull out the laptop for the football one on because... Uh -huh. Yeah, he's 5'3". I'm taller than him. 5'3", played in the NBA, was drafted in the first round, 1987. Whoever took him, legends. Yeah, they got all their money's worth, right? He... Let's see the stats here. Uh, he was... Let's see. First, six thousand points. Yep, six thousand. Six thousand. Six thousand assists. One thousand steals. Yep, one thousand three hundred sixty-nine steals. He averaged a steal and a half per game. Averaged seven point six assists per game and seven point seven points like per game. Westbrook's going on. Uh, didn't look like he won any. 
Um, no titles. He. Oh my god! All the money's worth. Yeah, he. Oh my. Uh, played for the. He was drafted by the Bullets, the Washington Bullets, um, which were before the Wizards. Then was traded to Charlotte. Uh, played in Charlotte for a long time, about sure? ten seasons. Uh, then went to Golden State for a couple seasons. Toronto to wrap it up. Um, but yeah, I mean, look, he was in Space Jam. All right, mm -hmm. he was in Space Jam. Yes, he was in Space Jam. Uh, one of the um. He was on Curb Your Enthusiasm. <laughs> I don't even remember that. What episode was on where he's on Curb Your Enthusiasm? <laughs> I gotta go watch that episode again. I was just reading the synopsis of it. Uh, made a cameo on SNL. So he had some... Uh, he definitely had some mainstream appeal because a guy that's 5'3", playing in the NBA, that's no easy feat. I mean, you're playing against giants. Yeah, he played around the same time Shaq played. I mean, imagine them on the court at the same time. <laughs> like, like it's not even fair. Like, it's it's not fair that they... Yet he held his own. Like I said, was not a um, Hall of Fame player, but a very well-known um, player for his era. And yeah, um, uh, there's... Like I said, there's objectively significantly better polls, but... No, there isn't. I know uh, the boy at one point was itching to get his hands on a signed Muggsy Bogues or Spud Webb jersey, uh, signed jersey, and they were going about for the price I paid for the box. Um, so in that sense, this is arguably not a bad... Um, Fury, what do you mean not a not, bad? Not you a bad pull great? here. I mean, for you, but like for, you know, for... Yeah, because you're not getting any money. Right. And I'm getting the Yeah, I'm yeah. not able to flip it. <laughs> I'm not able to put it up on eBay and sell it to for at least the cost of the box. Um, and you get another signed item that mm -hmm. you uh, are going to take from mm -hmm. the lot. So, mm -hmm. Muggsy Bogues is the pool. Uh, and not bad. Not bad one on that. Um, but that'll do it for the RSA Rochester Sports Autographs Basketball Mystery Box. Um, it is Muggsy Bogues. But, yeah, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you're new here, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Like to support me on Patreon, you can do so. Link is in the description below if you'd like to buy a t-shirt. A Tom Was Here t-shirt, you can do so. It's Spreadshirt, as well as links to my eBay store, Facebook page, Instagram, Clubhouse, and the Pennsylvania Autograph Collectors Association. Links are in the description below. RSA, did you grab any of the mystery boxes, whether it was football, baseball, basketball? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, but guys, thanks so much for watching. And until the next video, we will see you soon. But until then, bye everyone. Bye. Bye. Ah, you said bye. <laughs>